Hello everyone. In this video, I will cover one important interview question. The question is, how will you print every second observation from the data set? So let's say over here I have one data set dot class. So I want to print every second observation. That means I want Alice, then Carol, then James, then Janet, then John, like that. So every second observation. So not only second observation, they can ask you nth observation. Any nth observation, they will ask you to print. Okay. So how can you do it? So I have two methods to do that. So the first method is using mod. How will you use that? See, first we'll give data, new data set name. Set, I've taken sashelp.class over here. Now you have to use if. If mod parenthesis underscore n underscore comma two close parenthesis is equal to zero. I'll try to explain it to you. So mod, what does mod do? It returns the reminder. Okay, mod returns the reminder. Fine. I have given if conditional statement mod. What is underscore n underscore? That means the observation number. Underscore n underscore means observation number. That is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Over here we have nineteen observations. So it will divide all the nineteen observation with two. It will divide all the nineteen observations with two. Whose reminder should be zero? That is what I am giving. If all the observations divided by two, whose reminder will be zero? So obviously, two divided by two, the reminder will be zero. Four divided by two, then again it will divide with two. Then again, your reminder will be zero, right? This is how it works. So all your second observation from the data set will get printed. See why we got it. Alice, Carol, James, Janet over here. You can see Alice second one, fourth one is Carol, then James, then Janet. You can compare it, right? Alice, Carol, James, Janet. So it is correct. Now let's say we have to use it using proc SQL. That also we can do. Proc SQL semicolon select star. That means I will select all the variables to be present from sashelp dot class where as you know we cannot use if in proc sql so we'll use where see over here i have used mod instead of underscore n underscore the closely related option available in sql is monotonic parenthesis so i've written monotonic parenthesis instead of underscore n underscore comma 3 so now what i'll get reminder should be zero so I will get every third observation from the data set, correct? See, so I should get Barbara, James, Jeffrey. See, you will get that and then continue like that. See, you got Barbara, James, Jeffrey, like that you will get. So 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 and 18. Should end with Thomas, see. So this is how you will find it out. So it is an important interview question which has been asked for freshers and they can change. So they can ask you second, they can ask you third, they can ask you fifth observations, only the fifth observation from data set, every fifth observation. So that time only here the value will change. Just this, this and remaining it will remain the same. Okay. So thank you everyone. That's all in this video and prepare well for your interviews. I will also try to upload interview questions separately, which are, uh, you know, scenario based. So this is one scenario based question. Like that, I'll try to upload more questions. Thank you, everyone. Please subscribe to my channel.